your thoughts going into this tough uh, tough double header? Yeah, obviously it's a massive game for us. I mean, uh, we've watched, been watching them in meetings this week, and uh, they, they look a decent side. But if if we bring our A game, I'm sure we've uh, we've got enough to, to beat them. We've just got to turn up and uh, and play. There's been quite a change in the atmosphere and the way the team has played this season since um, Uzbekistan, because the, the result against Greece wasn't particularly good. But then turn in, turn of the season, then there's been three good results. What what have you made of the the performances so far? Yeah, definitely. I, th- I feel like a few, there's a few been a few fresh faces in, uh, and I think that's freshened things up. And uh, I feel really confident in the squad we've got. There's great morale, good banter. Got new lads like Jordan Henderson and that, and uh, they come in and done really well. And uh, it's uh, I'm feeling really confident about the squad we've got at the minute. It feels like I've been in this setup a lot longer than just a year. It was about a year ago when I played against Macedonia and Greece. And uh, yeah, I feel really comfortable in in the setup now. I've got to know everyone, and uh, I feel like I played some of my good football when I'm away with England. You've uh, yet to find the score sheet, but in training today, you you nailed a couple. Uh, <laughs> is that is that something you like trying to do? Get forward and get goals. Yeah, with my club, I've uh, been on good goal scoring form, and uh, I've yet to find the net for the twenty one jet, which is something that's playing on my mind a little bit, but. Hopefully, I can put that right over the next two games. And obviously, you had the pre season at, at United and uh, spending a lot of time amongst some of the world's best players at, at there. And, and obviously, you've got p- people like Danny Welbeck also who, who are there and uh, Chris Smalling who have come yeah. in this season. What's it like having players like that at, the, at Man United and also with you here at England? Yeah, it's good. I mean, uh, I think all the young lads at United are doing really well and it's nice to. To come through with Welbs and Smalling, and then come away together, and we still, it's, it's just a really gives, it's a really good buzz, and uh, we could bring that into this squad, and I just feel like it's a really, I enjoy coming to away with England, and it's a really good squad that we've got at the minute, and like I said, I feel like not only can we qualify, but I think we can do really well next summer as well. And the the key will be to to try and get some goals to take away to to Botashan next week. Yeah, f- first things first, we've got to keep a clean sheet. And with the quality in the side, I feel like we can get a couple of goals to take a, a lead to the away match next week. And that's been a thing this season as well, the, the clean sheets. of Three mm. three games, three clean sheets, plus a few goals as well. And it's a uh, bodes well for, for a tough couple of games. Yeah, I mean, uh, John has come in and done really well. Chris has cemented his place and Kyle and Ryan have, d- have done really well as well. And uh, not to forget Frankie, who... He's waited his time and done really well when he come in, so I think they deserve a lot of credit for that. And uh, if they can get a couple of clean sheets or one clean sheet in the next two games, I think we've got every chance. And uh, when you pull on the three lines, what's the what's the most um, what's the pride that you feel when you when you pull that on? What do you think about most? Yeah, definitely. I think just just my family and stuff really, and uh, everything that's gone before, like just working working to put the shirt on and you you get the buzz when the national anthems are on and then and then the game just takes care of itself. What's it like around the hotel? Yeah, it's really good to be fair. I mean, like I said, I enjoy coming away. It is, it is like we're with each other all the time, to be fair. Uh, the banter's good. Um, it's, just, it's just a good good setup we've got going on here. And what, what sort of things do you do around the hotel? Is there, is there any games or anything that you can... Um, there's a little, there's a little table tennis championship in the last, in the last hotel, which uh, I'd, I'd probably say I'm just edging John Henderson at the minute. <laughs> We've got Danny Sato there. He got his first couple of goals um, last month. Has he, has he been talking about that much? Yeah, I mean, uh, <laughs> he was buzzing to be fair on the way back up. <laughs> nah, but Danny, Danny's a good lad. He's done well and like he's he's waited his time as well. And he's up close. Done really well. <laughs> you got Jordan Henderson there. He's, he's new to the squad. What, what do you feel about the boys, Jordan? You enjoyed your time. You enjoyed your time with the new squad. Why you getting me involved? You said you wanted well, to get involved. Hey, got nervous. He's, he's, he's oh no, Mike. He's gone red. Oh god. He's <laughs> tweaking. <laughs> oh, he's gone shy. Well, thank you very much, Tom. Nice one. Cheers. Cheers.